Hello everyone and welcome to today's Python tutorial video. In this tutorial we will learn how to install pip on our computer system. Pip is a package manager for Python, which makes it easy to install and manage Python libraries and packages. So installing pip on your computer system has become a necessity for all Python users. Without any further ado, let's dive right in. The TNO Synergic Metaverse, where imagination meets discovery. Open your favorite web browser and type Python install pip. Go to the official website of piper.io by clicking on the hyperlink from the search results. The link is also provided in the description and you may use that if you are facing any difficulties. Once you are on the website, locate the get-pip.py script link. Right click on it and select save link as to save the file to your computer. Choose the destination folder and click on save to begin the download. The download process should begin automatically. After the file has been downloaded, open the command prompt to install the script. In the command terminal, type the address of the directory where you have downloaded the script. In our case, we have downloaded it to the downloads folder. So we type cd space c colon slash users slash hp slash downloads and press enter. We can see that the directory has changed to downloads. Now we type python space get hyphen pip dot pi and press enter. You can see pip being installed. PIP will now be installed on your system. You should see some output indicating that the installation was successful. Now, it is time to verify our installation. To verify that the PIP was installed correctly, let's check its version. Open a new command terminal and type the command PIP space hyphen hyphen version. And there you have it. You should see the version of the PIP displayed, indicating that it was installed successfully. Now you can easily install and manage Python libraries and packages for your projects. If you like this video, don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tutorials like this one. Click on the video shown on the screen to proceed to the next part of the tutorial. Thank you for watching this tutorial and see you in the next video.